a very good afternoon to Stephen Hendry and John Ford. Yes, thank you, Jason. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, everybody. Well, what a great match we've got in store here. Full, tremendous Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Builders. We could be in the for a frame. classic. Sean Murphy to break. Yeah, John, this could be... It could be almost like watching an exhibition match, this, today. I just cannot see any frames lasting longer than 20 minutes. I can't see many safety shots being played. This could be... Could be the match of the tournament, this one, if both players play to their ability. Judd decided to turn that long pot down. Main reason being he thought it was a risky pot and wasn't guaranteed position on the colour. Yeah, I mean, I think it's going to be a terrific encounter and hopefully both players play well. If I could give an edge in one department, and, and this might seem a strange thing to say, Judd's safety play. It's improved over the last couple of seasons and, and Sean, to me, always struggles a little bit in the safety side. But it'll be all about when you get your chances, taking them. Yeah, and I think and no matter when you watch Sean Murphy, no matter how well he plays, you always sense he's going to give you chances. There's always going to be that careless shot in there somewhere, you think. He's very good at that safety shot, Judd Trump, playing with lots of side, around three or four cushions. Okay, a little bit short and reaching the bulk cushion, but negotiated the path of the cue ball very well. Well, John, there's an example. Sometimes Sean Murphy's careless safety plate. Well, we must hit that by a long way. I mean, to kiss the black. Unbelievable. One. Not the best shot from Judd, wrong side of the blue. Now there is one loose red. Whether he feels he's got enough angle to force this cue ball in between green and brown and go into the cluster. Now playing for the one loose red. Needed to have a little bit more pace in it. Six. But there's always bound to be a little bit of tension in the arm, first frame. Screwing off the bunch here. Hopefully land in black. Maybe up for a blue. The seven. It's just a very aggressive shot. To have such confidence in your ability to play those. And obviously with Twelve. Ronnie O'Sullivan losing yesterday, obviously Ronnie's virtually owned this tournament the last few years. All these top players will be sensing an opportunity. Thirteen. Nice touch. Yeah, played that really well. Yeah, these two players still left in it who have won this Masters title. Sean Murphy being one of them, of course, and John Higgins. 
But Karen Wilson, Mark Allen, Judd Trump, still to add this great title to their CV. Yeah, and all very aggressive players left in the tournament. Play the game the right way. Trent. Pretty impressive in his first round match. Judd Trump. Without being at his absolute best. 21. The key to winning these big events is to get better as the tournament goes on. Twenty-eight. Thirty-five. Thirty-six. And this is a shot. Such confidence. The first frame, as you said, John, you might be a wee bit etchy in the first frame, but to screw through the bunch, look what he's leaving. Should he miss it? Incredible talent, Judd Trump. 43. Now it's very important he gets a good angle on the blue here because that was the 44. last of the loose reds. Maybe a little bit too much angle. Now, normally we say run into the pink. He wants to avoid the pink here. Just run past the right hand side of the pink as we look. Mm, but even then, it's gone wrong. 49. Wanted to make the join of those two reds together. And maybe with slightly less pace, but that's only being wise after the event. He's going to play the easiest safety shot is off the red and the right hand side cushion, but there's no way he's going to play that. Judd Trump, 49. To the right cushion. Take the cue ball somewhere behind the green on the bolt cushion. Of course, this is the nature of snooker. Trump got 49 and opened the reds. But now, if Sean Murphy was to get the next chance, then he wouldn't have a lot to do. Yeah, I think the first shot that Judd Trump played, the safety shot, was perhaps he's a little bit wary of Sean Murphy's long game designed to play a bit more containing safety today. He's definitely in the top two or three in the world, Sean Murphy, consistently getting long pots. Everyone on their day can be brilliant, but day in, day out, it's just so strong in that department. Well, that's worked out okay for Judd. There's possibly a red that will pot the one immediately in between the 
black and pink, thin cut. It's got that much too thin, not settled yet, Sean. Played that with a lot of left-hand side just to check the cue ball up and couldn't have played it any better. This red will cut back into the left corner. Mm, well, he caught it much too thick. And here's a chance now for Judd. If he knocks in this long red, you'd think it would be the frame clincher. John Trump is never as comfortable when he's rolling balls in. Always prefers to be screwing the cue ball or punching the cue ball. Yeah, he missed that by a long way, and he's fortunate, really, to have left the cue ball near the side cushion. As you can see, the way the reds are now, if, if Sean was to get... Cushion first, probably here. Kicking the red up the table. Thank you. He's got a good cue ball. Wasn't guaranteed to have a good cue ball, mine. But being close to the cushion, nothing easy for Judd to go at. As you can see, he can pot this red to the corner. Now which is the more risky, the pot or the safety. Taking the pot on. Don't blame him. But once again, a long way away. And now Sean Murphy gets his opportunity. Won't be playing the one to the left corner, he's hampered. But he's got one to the right middle and one to the right corner. Wow. It's amazing this game, isn't it? It's amazing. He's just not settled. It. He's just not settled yet. He played at that pace because he didn't expect to hit the red in the right-hand side of the pocket. That's why he ran through and off. And yeah. I'm amazed just turning this down, Stephen. Yeah, that's a, this is a very um, defensive shot. But yeah, I thought the, the shot that Sean Murphy played, if that's straight, surely you play the one above the black instead. Yeah, maybe the, the two long balls that Judd missed by a long Judd pots the next red, he'll win the frame. He's already had one scare, I'm certain, when he went back to his seat. When he left Sean with that chance. I don't think he was too bothered about getting the cue ball back to bulk there. The important thing was just not getting a double kiss and leaving a red on. Three point lead, Judd Trump, but there's plenty of reds available, so a long way to go for the winning post yet. Hmm, <coughs> be disappointed with that one. 
Now, Sean's had a couple of goals that, similar to our reds, one with a safety and one with a cut, and he's cut them too thin. If he catches this just right. A chance now to get right back in the frame. One. Black looks to be the ball to play, and if you're going to play the black, you may as well play the cannon and try and bring these four reds into play. Sean Murphy won. Yeah, it was a big shot. It was the right shot. And I knew, he knew if he missed it, it was probably going to cost him the frame. Sometimes the risks you have to take at this level. One. Yep, so he's had two half chances of Sean to get right back in this frame, but he'll be lucky to get another one. Fifty-nine points to lead, so just looking for this red. Seven. This red will put him sixty ahead with fifty-nine remaining. Eight. Thirteen. Fourteen. Twenty. Twenty one. Twenty seven, twenty eight, mm -hmm. that nicely, thirty five, thirty six. Bit of an exhibition shot here, part of the black coming between off the ball cushion. Well, he didn't play to can in the yellow. 43. But the yellow went in nicely. 45. He's on the green nicely for a left hander. So you would say that Judd Trump has certainly settled the better of the two players, judging on this open fra opening frame. The only thing that would concern Judd slightly is 52. he got a couple of long pots and missed them by quite a distance. 52. As I say, just a few exhibition shots, which is what he likes to do. Little smile from both players, nice to see.